Frédéric Constant was established in 1988 with the goal of bringing accessible luxury to everyone and is a brand that we have never covered on this channel before, mainly since I haven't seen anything that I felt that you all would be interested in until now. We now have a piece from them that I think that you all will be able to appreciate, which is called the Slimline Monolithic. It has a unique in-house movement in it that will blow your mind, which functions at 288,000 beats per hour and has a monolithic or one-piece oscillator slash escapement that is made out of flexious technology that actually flexes on itself instead of needing axles or jewels. But will this first offering with the movement be the one for you, or will you wait to see if it comes out in other forms later? Let's find out. What's up everyone, it's Chris with the Little Treasury Channel. Welcome back. This is where we bring you awesome watch content at least once a week. And if you haven't already, please make sure to smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell to be alerted as soon as we upload. I'm from Little Treasury Jewelers, which is located in Gambrels, Maryland. And it's where you go when you're in the know. As always, the watches that I review are for sale and can be purchased, so please see the description below to contact us. If you're just joining us now, I'll go over the watch's detailed measurements and features, and then I'll offer my humble opinion at the end. In our last video, I reviewed the Grand Seiko SBGC 247, which is a limited edition chronograph that has a specially regulated spring drive caliber and a fascinating snow textured dial. I recommend checking this one out if you are interested in a Grand Seiko chronograph or a chronograph in general. Wrist check time. Today I'm wearing my Grand Seiko Snowflake just because it has a similar secondhand movement to the watch that we are reviewing today, although they are regulated in completely different ways. Now tell me which watch you're wearing while you're watching the video and make sure to tell me why. Now let's get on to the features. The Frederic Constant Slimline Monolithic has a 39.9 millimeter case width, an 11.5 millimeter thickness, a 45 millimeter lug to lug, a 20 millimeter lug width, a 35.7 millimeter crystal diameter, and weighs in at 70.77 grams. The case is high polished completely with no frills and is made out of three pieces with a vintage style crown found at the three position that is not screwed down. The crystal is slightly domed and is made out of sapphire. The dial is in blue with a guilloche Klaus de Paris decoration. It has white minute ticks around the edge and Roman numerals for the indices, with 12 and 6 missing. At the top middle portion, you will find the date subdial with white numerals and a white hand. The hour and minute hands are Breguet style and are in white, with the second hand being white as well. Frederic Constant and Geneve can be found at the right middle portion in white and are raised slightly off of the dial on a pedestal. An open heart showing the monolithic oscillator can be found at the sixth position. No loom can be found on this piece. The case back is open and shows off the FC810 caliber, which has circular satin finishing, anglage, and circular Cotes de Geneve's decorations. It also has the limited edition number. The movement here is what really makes this piece special, and I'm going to try to keep this as simple as possible. It has the FC810 caliber in it, which uses a proprietary silicone monolithic oscillator that replaces 26 components of a standard escapement slash oscillator with one piece. Its specialized nature and powerful gear train allow it to beat at 288,000 beats per hour or 40 hertz. Here's what it looks like at normal speed. Now here is what it looks like slowed down five times. Even five times slow, it is still moving extremely fast. Now let's see what that does to the movement of the second hand, which now ticks at 80 steps per second versus the eight steps on a 28,800 standard movement. Does that look smooth to you? The efficiency of the one piece oscillator design allows this movement to have an 80 hour power reserve and will be accurate to between losing four and gaining six seconds per day. However, I was told that this is most likely more like one second a day. A quirk of this movement is that you will actually hear it humming and it is noticeable if you are in a quiet room. Another fun quirk of this movement is that you are supposed to give it a tap to start it up when it's completely dead. The strap is a blue alligator leather with white stitching and has a pull to open folding buckle with the FC crest on it. The slimline monolithic is limited to 810 pieces total, is 30 meter water resistant, and can be yours for $4,795. 
Now for my humble opinion. Honestly, folks, this is exciting. While I'm not a dress watch fan myself, this is a very handsome watch and the blue on this dial is striking. But what I'm really excited about is this movement, which although I gave an overview of it, many more details do exist. And this could be a real game changer if put into the correct timepiece in the future. Imagine this in a dive watch. I really love the quirky hum of the movement and how the oscillator is just going crazy every time you look at it. This piece fits great on my six and a half inch wrist and wears comfortably. I actually really like this. And if I had to choose a dress watch, this might be one that I would actually think to pick up because of this movement. At this price point, a movement this innovative is totally unheard of. And I'm a bit surprised that it is priced this way. I will recommend this to anyone who is looking for a fun and exciting dress watch and would like to experience a totally new and innovative movement. And if it catches on, then this piece at only 810 pieces could become quite valuable someday. Thanks for watching today, everyone. I really hope you enjoyed the video. And of course, if you did, please make sure to smash that subscribe button, give this video a like, and share with all of your friends and your family members too. I look forward to seeing you next video.